This is what I've been eating lately. I took a couple of potatoes, they're pretty good size, and then I mashed them into some, some mashed potatoes. I cook them with a couple of diced celery, and then I add, I don't know, less than a cup of, maybe, yeah, about a third of a cup of frozen corn at the end, and I'll season it with a little coconut liquid aminos. And this has been the latest thing, is these veggies with some red pepper in it. It's steamy, but it smells so good. So steaming some mixed non-starchy veggies, asparagus, broccoli, zucchini, onion, and the red pepper. Oh, I just love it. Hi, ladies. How Hello. are you? Hello. This is my friend, Darren Hinton. I call her the matriarch of Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's, anyway, but she's a whole lot more than that. She's a wonderful, wonderful friend. And she's in my house. That's even <laughs> more wonderful. <laughs> so I told Darren as she came to visit today, and I said, do you want to try some of my food, my vegan food? Because Darren, she's not vegan. At least not yet. No, I I eat anything except for liver. <laughs> <laughs> Darren had me take her downtown to figure out where to buy her meat and cheese. See, and that was awesome. <laughs> she really taught me where to go, and everybody loves her, and they give her cheaper prices than people that actually look like they're from this country. <laughs> <laughs> it does happen sometimes. Okay, so. How do you like living in Mexico so far? I love it. I love it. And I did have a business in Cabo San Lucas for 16 years, but that's not really Mexico. Do you it's know what different. I mean? Yeah, it's different. It's here. different. And I love it here. And so we will see. Yeah. Mexico's got a part of my heart. That's, that's cool. Me too. <laughs> okay, so I made a little bit of my mashed potatoes and some kind of like a stir fry veggie mix and Darren is going to try it. So she's either going to like it or she's going to say this like food has no taste to it. So let's, so it's just going to be fun. We're going to be fun and we're going to see what she thinks. But also what you've got to realize is that I over season everything I eat. Okay, so. <laughs> All right, so before it gets too cold, here yes. we go. All right, now here comes the food. We try to keep it warm. Okay. All right. And All right. here we go. This is Lori's food. <laughs> this is Lori's food and it's good for me. Yep, but let's see if she thinks it has any flavor. <laughs> oh, wow, it is good. I see how you really used natural things to bring out the flavor. You can add salt. I Because I don't think there's any, huh? I will just okay. because that's the way I, I roll. I, <laughs> yeah, because I think I add salt to it too, so don't feel. It's yeah. good though. Mmm. Mm. The veggies. Yes, and now the veggies. And now the veggies. And I understand how good vegetables are for me. <laughs> I do. <laughs> <laughs> but I like my meat, right? <laughs> Absolutely. I eat things that have a face. Mm. All right. Thank mm. you. Hi, ladies. My name is Lori, and I will never diet again. I'm a conservative Christian, a wife, mother, grandmother, pastor's wife, and my family and I have lived in Mexico since 2004. I'm so glad you've come to join me today. Welcome to my kitchen. Like and subscribe, please.